Hi, I'm Tom Ladd. We're here at the Midwest Nationals training facility in Springfield for the photo shoot of the 2018 Ozarks Baseball Preview. I have with me the Magnificent 11 selection, Hayden McCarthy of the Halfway Cardinals. And uh, Hayden, first off, congratulations on this. Thank you. What does this mean to you? Uh, it means a lot. It been some uh, great baseball players that have been selected for this over the years, and, and now you're among them. Yeah, um, it's a great opportunity for me, honestly. I'm greatly uh, thankful to be here. Talk a little bit about uh, your sophomore season. Here you are a junior now at halfway. Uh, talk about last year for you. Uh, last year I was a pretty good hitter, pretty good fielder overall. I hit 573, I believe. Um, I, I was there to hit in the runs when we need them the most, and I think that's what mattered. What position defensively? Uh, shortstop. A lot of shortstops on the uh, Magnificent 11 squad, usually the best athletes. Uh, and then offensively, where'd you learn how to hit? Uh, I've been getting hitting lessons for a while. Um, I play for the Midwest Nationals, actually. Okay. So I come here four times a week, getting lessons throughout the week. So I've had a lot of training into it. So no, you didn't need any directions to get here like some, huh? No, I, I knew exactly where <laughs> I was going. We'll visit with uh, Coach Wig right now. And Coach, talk about uh, this player and what he's meant to your program. Very good. He's probably one of the best shortstops, hand-wise, strength, arm, arm strength. Uh, Hitting-wise, he's probably one of the best I've seen in a long time. I've been in the business about 20 years. He's pretty good. But really, next year, you'll probably see him as a pitcher. He's going to be probably my one or two pitcher. He should have been last year, but he had a, a surgery in his sophomore year. His uh, growth plate broke, so we didn't use him at all. So we're trying to save him for this year and his senior year. So uh, pitching, uh, talk a little bit about that. Did, did, were you able to throw some during the uh, summer with the Nationals? Uh, over the summer, I threw towards the end, but I was recovering throughout there, basically mm -hmm. building my arm strength back up because I broke my growth plate right oh, here. Oh, wow. And I have a screw in there, so I've been building my arm strength back up. And like I said, I come up here every week. I have a thing tonight for pitching, so this year I'll be pitching a lot. But the hitting will always continue, right? Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> you never want to miss one of those days. Nope, never. What about the Cardinals? Uh, talk about the team. Uh, Coach, we'll, we'll ask you a little bit about the team this year. Well, we're coming off of a quarterfinal loss. Um, so hopefully we've lost uh, one starter. All, all eight's coming back. So we should be just as strong as we were last year, if not stronger, especially if we get Hayden on yeah. the mound. He will will definitely do good. Almost seems like uh, he's going to be a difference maker on the mound for you. He, yes, he will be. You know, if we got two outs, bases loaded in the bottom of the seventh, he's the one I want up. Yeah. And that's, you know, kind of player he is. Who are the who are the big competitors? Who are the teams you need to – whip up on a little uh, bit this Walnut year. Walnut Grove. Oh, yeah. You know, we we beat them in districts, so I would say that put a target on our back. And, you know, hopefully we can win the conference this year. Walnut Grove, a solid, solid yeah, team over the years. Yes, they are. Yep. And, uh, you know, we did beat them, and, you know, we're proud of that. But, you know, it's another year. Well, Hayden, uh, first team all state in class one, uh, first team all district, uh, all Polk League County last year. So a lot of a lot of honors after the season that had to make you feel good. Yeah, it felt pretty good. Um, knowing that I'm one of the best around Polk County League feels great. Do you get a little humbled then? You go to the Nationals and uh, play against some of those teams and with some of the players from the area. Is it a humbling experience or do you fit right in with everybody? I fit right in with everybody. A lot of them are for bigger schools though, so I usually don't play a lot of them. So yeah. I meet a lot of new people. Guys here today, uh, you know several of them, I'm sure. Oh yeah, I know a lot of these guys around here. I We're pretty good friends too, so. Play against or with them, I would imagine, during the summer? Oh yeah, I play with some of them, yep. so. What about college? What uh, you you have anything in mind at this point? Oh, uh, I'm only 16 actually. I'm like a really young junior, so I haven't made an official decision yet. But I'm definitely interested in playing baseball. So, at what level? And uh, do you want to move away? A lot of players, you know, they want to stay close. Uh, some want to move away. Does it matter? Uh, no, I'll go anywhere. So, I, I'll do anything I can. It's a pretty good baseball played around this area in the college level. So it wouldn't be bad to stay around here, huh? Yeah, that wouldn't be bad. I wouldn't mind. So. Yeah. 
Coach, talk about uh, the season this year in, in uh, conference and then in and districts again and what you guys look forward to uh, and what your expectations are. Well, we start off our season uh, March 17th um, against Skyline. So that will kind of test where we're at. Um, the conference, you know, we should be in the top one or two in the conference. Uh, districts, the good thing about it is we host districts at home oh. this year. So with the five seniors we have, you know, it's nice to be at home for districts. It is nice uh, to have everybody back, uh, just losing one player. Uh, just the familiarity of uh, playing with those guys uh, throughout the season, right? Yeah, we got a good team chemistry going, so pretty strong group. Yep. Well, guys, uh, again, we uh, congratulate you and wish you the best of luck at halfway this year. Thank, Thank you. you. And again, uh, Hayden, congratulations on being named 2018 Magnificent 11 selection for the Ozarks Baseball Preview. I'm Tom Ladd.